Hello everyone, I'm Nate Asher and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Master of Time. In the last episode, we found the ice area and all we did is get this piece of heart across here. So, in this episode, we are going to be exploring more of this area and hopefully find some more stuff. Because we do have all of the um, the stones that we need to go to the path of the gods, but uh, we don't have the third medallion. So I'm not sure if like we get that here or what the case might be. Uh, But hopefully we can figure that out. Ooh. Oh no! What in the world? Oh. Hey. That's dangerous. Oh my, we're gonna need the Zora tunic if we're gonna attempt this. I'm worried Link's not gonna be able to breathe. Smart of them to put that ramp there though, so that you can get out. Yeah, well, uh, maybe that's where we're supposed to be trying to get to. Thing is, we can't even buy a Zora tunic right now because it costs like 300 rupees and our wallet only allows us to hold 250. This is where we came from, right? Yeah. Alright, so we went down there. We went inside there and got that heart piece. <clears throat> And now we just went around and jumped off. Is there nothing else that... I'm sure there is more up there if I didn't jump off. Um... Pretty cool area, actually. I like the design of it. Kind of like, um, seems as though it was like shaped naturally, you know, like not, not symmetrical, not pretty necessarily. I wonder what that is up there. At first I thought that that thing up here, I don't know if I can... thing right there, that like pink area. At first I thought that looked like um the twilight from Twilight Princess, but I realize it's just the the sun. It's the quad sun or whatever divided up into four because of the graphics plugin. or something right there. Where's this music from? Wait a minute, can we get up there? Oh, hey. You're back. Great. Oh, come on. 
Heck yeah. Oh, what? That was weird. Wonder why we weren't oh, able to, like, get across. Let's try something. <laughs> I'm so good, dude. If you don't know um, what happened, or you don't play much Zelda, or watch any Zelda speedrunning, basically, uh, it was the game didn't register that um, that edge as like an actual ledge that Link can jump off of, um, which is why the first time that I tried, he just like fell, but what I did is if you stand right on the edge of, a, of the ledge that you want to jump off of, put a bomb behind you, and turn around, and you have to like Z-target and have your shield out, um, because otherwise... Like, in, okay, in short, you can only roll if you're running, unless you're targeting and sh um, you hit A. So, I targeted so that I could just hit A to roll, and I did the shield so that I wouldn't um, get knocked back from the bomb. So, and you don't have to use the shield, but I wanted to be safe. So yeah, I just used the the explosion that was going to push me that way anyway and went ahead and rolled as it was exploding so that as I was rolling it would let me roll and then Link does his little hop but the force from the bomb carried me the, the rest of the way over like if the bomb wasn't there I wouldn't have near enough speed to have made that jump from just rolling What is up here? Of course it's a piece of heart. Of course it is. Yeah, there. Man, I need like a... Like an input display or something. Especially if I'm gonna continue... Giving these like mini, mini tutorials on... I thought it was just a aesthetic, like, ancient old house. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Actually needed that, so... Am I supposed to, like, shoot this thing down? Or what? Is that... What's the point of it? Oh, you can go up there. Up there okay. That didn't work, but somehow you can get up there, it looks like. Thank <laughs> you. 
don't know, can you guys do what I'm supposed to do here? I was gonna say we could play the last Rampart song and see if there's like a like a one of those time blocks. Master song. I wish it told you more about it. This is a loading. Okay. All right. All right. I gotta go do something. We'll be right back. All right, I'm back. What is? Ooh. Oh my gosh. First I thought might be a friendly Poe, but. What is this? I will die here. I'm cold, hungry, and injured. Here are probably my last words. Red ice makes me crazy. I tried everything I could, but it doesn't want to break. Land is very dangerous. Should have better prepared myself. Can't see the truth. You will not go far. And it was a really bad idea to come here naked. Probably the main cause of my death. <laughs> also, if you didn't know to make one of these poses, like, like here, I'll make it disappear. When you target it, it'll disappear. But if you use a Deku Nut. Am I saying the right thing? You stare at it with Z, targeting it will disappear. Yeah, we know that. Hmm. I'll have to like check that. Next time I'm playing OT because like yeah I'm I'm fairly sure about the the deck you know thing. Working in Ocarina of Time, at least, is what I mean. But I see an eye switch. So we're gonna need uh, some blue fun. 
Is it called blue fire or blue fire? I think it's blue fire. You need some blue fire to get through the red eyes. Oh, I already see. Oh. Nope, not today, buddy. Need one eye switch. Okay, that took care of one of those gates, but there were multiple. Oh, okay. What even was that? Oh, there's a uh, one up there that needs melted. That's a little bit trickier to spot. Heck yeah. That took care of one of the gates as well. Oh, you're supposed to get it from here. Whoops. Dude, this freaking... This is scary, like, normally... I just... Do you just freeze randomly in here? This is... Odd. Oh wait, maybe that's the uh, lens of truth thing. Aha! Uh -huh. you, you notice that? Look at that keys. It's invisible freaking keys. If I can hit it from here. Yeah, man. What? There's another. What am I missing? Hmm. Got that one. Got that one. The fart's been on all the, um, I guess you'd call them icicles rather than stalactites. Aha! Uh -huh. But that was a. Good observation. What? Yeah, I know the iron bar fall. But you know, as I was saying, like they've been on all these stuff stalactites or like I guess it's probably called bicycles in here, and probably not like actual stalactites. Anyway. Gosh. Come on. There's so many. Get me out. Right. Dang. Can't come out the other side. Gotta be another one somewhere. There's one on here. There. Guess I didn't check this. Wasn't even from an ice switch. What was that third ice switch for then? Unless there was three gates, but oh, well. figure it out. That's all that matters, right? Get the head out of this room.
Mm -hmm. Okay. All these puzzles are actually like yeah, they're they're definitely I don't know. They're they're different from the uh the pattern this game has had in the sense that it's like stuff that I've been trained to not even I don't know how to explain it it's like that was just for really easy and a stupid solution but but uh, I did want to... Oh crap, we're running low on magic. I need to be more caring about that. But I was wanting to look at the room more. Freaking janky. No, dude. I never have the freaking item equipped that I'm trying to use. Get out of here. Nice face. I'm not saying this face is bad or anything. It like, it, if it's like supposed to look natural and it just happens to look like a face, but if they were going for like the same same kind of idea as uh, in like the Spirit Temple from Ocarina of Time, where there's a giant statue. Hmm. Sorry. Then I think they would have been better off just like importing some kind of icy looking model that was already I have no idea. I'm gonna get like all the way to the top of here and it's gonna be like, here's your piece of heart. Dude. Oh, that was so lucky. Uh. Oh, dude, he busted his nut. Finally, Le Blue Fire.
Yes, that was a pretty straight, straight forward room. It was definitely a linear room in terms of ways that you can go. Oh no, dude. I just saw more than one doorway. Ugh. Which way did I even... Is that the way that I came in? Man, I don't... How do I get through there? I'm like looking for any crystal switches underneath the ice. Good news is, is that if there are bars on a door, then the the key to getting through this door has to be in the same room. Maybe there's like a hidden switch somewhere. Something. magic. I was gonna say maybe it's like invisible or something. Yeah. Uh... More 
team card. Let's see if this gives us any magic. Like, you catch a Poe, it can be a random result. It gave me health, but sometimes it'll take hearts, sometimes it gives you hearts. More blue fire. So I'm guessing the, the first blue fire is just to unlock easy access to this one. See what I would. No, I don't want to watch or read that again. I just need magic. Oh, 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 it's magic. You know. Where can we get some magic right quick? Oh god! <laughs> Scare the crap out of me. Oh. oh my gosh. What the heck? Not what I needed, but um, alright. Did not like that. That's where I came from. Okay, good. to see where this like convoluted setup takes us. The friggin' owl, dude, is like Kapora Gabora. Ah, finally here. You took your time, boy. I started to get cold. Welcome to Lausanne Castle. A very rich castle before the rise of the dead. Now it's just abandoned ruins. Sounds like a job for Simon Belmont. Wrong game. So you know you need six medallions to save the world. I do? In this game? Oh man, dude. Give me a long game. Not a bad thing, but I didn't know that we would still be playing this for much longer. But you can find one of them here in the in the Death Castle. I thought it was a Lozane Castle. But it is a very perilous place. You will need some magic to succeed. <laughs> well, shoot. <laughs> I guess we'll go back then. Magic to see the truth. You wanna hear what I said again? God, no. You're a smart kid. Good luck then. Woohoo! I'll, I'll make owl noises for you guys. Well, I guess we gotta come back with magic. Man, I didn't think that there would be uh, near this much to explore here in the ice place. It's actually, pretty cool. Kind of looking forward to it, but um, anyway, guys, uh, that's gonna do it for this one. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like. I had fun with this, and uh, I'm I'm still looking forward to exploring the rest of this icy you know, wasteland. 
and uh, and checking all that we can find. So, yeah, uh, if you want to keep exploring, then make sure you're subscribed. That way, you get notified whenever uh, I upload the next one. And uh, you can do that by just clicking the subscribe button down. It's free. Um, but yeah, I think that's all for me, guys. I will see you then. Bye.